ignorant of this one thing that the one day is with the Lord as a thousand years and a thousand years is one day. The Lord is not slack concerning his promise. As some men count slackness, but is long suffering to us were not willing that any should perish, but that all should come to repentance. But the day of the Lord will come as a thief in the night in the which the heavens shall pass away with a great noise. With a great noise, that's the missiles. The thief Ooh. in the night. <laughs> that's right. What do they want to do about that? They ain't going to do yeah. shit about it. They're going to burn. <laughs> oh, no, they're going to cry out of Jesus. Yeah, they're going to cry out of Jesus. Yeah, they're going oh, yeah. yeah. to do that they're too. They're like, oh, God. 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 Oh, God that all these things shall be dissolved. What manner of person ought ye to be in all holy conversation and godliness? How come you ain't preaching the love of Jesus? Oh, man, I thought we were. <laughs> what about love? You always preaching hate. Yeah, what are y'all? Brother, you should have been out here like a what, an hour oh, ago. Man. man, we was on fire, man. Oh, man. man. We was going into the love, and that's all, man. He's talking about a man. spectacle. It was a spectacle out here. <laughs> yes, man, it was I a crowd. I haven't had nothing to eat all day, so I had to go to that little, that little whirling house, man, and grab me a little plate of applesauce and leave. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Yeah, it was you know crazy. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Like Deuteronomy 28, 48 says, <laughs> one of all things, you must serve thine enemies. Yep, yep, food, yep, water, yep. hunger. Ooh. One of all Curses on those I know I'll be uh, breaking my back and my feet at this Curses warehouse, but down. you know, thank the most high. We, we, we almost all punished. Right, that you, you can eat. Saying? That you can eat, yep, yep, yep. We almost all punished. This spirit kicks the shit over. I gotta go to court tomorrow, Friday, you know what I'm saying? Oh, shit, bro, I still got fucking about $300 in fines. Mm -hmm. Fuck that court shit. Down, That's some evil, wicked shit, man. Exactly. That court system is so goddamn complicated. I guess a court is a game. Exactly. It's like you play basketball on a court. They don't warn me no sort of point hey, hey, cussing hey, to raise hey, my daughter hey. in this truth. Mm. Lord mm. coming. They'll yeah. take it. They'll try to this take it. This world turn my like daughter into a war. This is about to try. Yeah, right, right, right. I've been right. raising her up in this truth for real. I heard, I heard that. Yeah. As best as you can, at least. As best as you can. But this is where I Looking for and hasting. Unto the coming of the day of the Most High Yahweh, Hashem Yahweh Shai, wherein the heavens, being on fire, shall be dissolved, and the elements shall melt with fervent heat. That's what Bam! That's yep. it. What you got? What this you got, is, this is why the Most High created the blacksmith. Go for it. <laughs> yeah. Psalms 10 and 2. Go the wicked up. in his pride doth persecute the poor. Let them be taken. Like, like you say, you go going to court. That's all they do at that courthouse, persecute the poor. Yep. Everybody ain't got no money, but they taking everything you got. Yep. This is Psalms The 10. first thing you see when you go in the courtroom is what? Cash register. Yep. As soon as you they walk, they got a whole line. A line up. Line up. They, got they cashing you out. Yep, you tie his cashiers. Even it's when a child is born, they want to figure out how much they're going to get off this person. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's pretty much what your birth certificate is. What's so that crazy that they said that. by the age you by the age of two they can determine your whole life where you're gonna end up. Damn. Here we go, let me finish this. Psalms 10 and 2. The wicked in his pride doth persecute the poor. Let them be taken in the devices that they have imagined. That's right, they imagine this new world order. They imagine, imagine them uh, uh, they imagine the success of uh, uh, these concentration camps that, man, they're What's that, what's that verse about uh, uh, they sent crappy counsel among these uh, people? That's in Psalms. Is that Psalms too? Yeah, Psalms 83. Psalms That's part of the poor schooling, mm -hmm. all this stuff, man. Yeah. This is a whole system they designed. Esau's, uh, uh, he's a he's stupid, but Cunning he's smart. Murder. He's cunning. I mean, like, yeah. you know, no, he's a fool. But he's a cunning and, and, You know, the judge, when you go to court, the judge is really a high priest of Baal. And he know, I mean, he knows, he's, you know, a lot of people, like, the judges got, are initiated. They're actually priests of Baal. They know this. That's why they wear the black robe. You know what I mean? The crazy thing is, why the hell they got the Bible to make the right here? Yeah, the Bible says, the, the Bible is what it is like. Well, so the, Bible said, the Bible say, yeah. the Bible say you're not supposed to swear on anything. It's for decoration. I mean, how is that Matthew the fifth chapter? It says, "Don't swear on anything." You ain't supposed to take uh, 
swear on the Bible and on the Lord. That's going totally against the Bible. Yeah, yeah. Check so, this so out. They, Crafty counsel amongst our people. That's man. sacrilege, you know what I mean? Yep. Job um, 30 and 8, they are children of fools. Yea, children of based men. Base men. Ba base means low. They're low lives. Just like the serpent in the... Uh, the Lord cursed the serpent. He said, "You're gonna eat dust all the days of your life. To eat dust just means you low. You're a piece of shit. Yeah, you a low life. Piece of shit. You on the you in the dirt. <laughs> like yeah. just like we lowly now. And the Lord said the you know, how he gave reference reference to who he who's last shall be first. Yeah, he who's first shall be last. You know. Okay. Like, you come out here pushing this truth, man. Like this, man. People look at you like you a piece of a piece of shit. Yeah, your woman will leave you." If you teach this truth, your whole family will come against you. They look at you yeah, like, like what's up with you and this, this Israelite thing? Even friends you grow up with, they be like, oh, you're a black Hebrew Israelite. Right black black Hebrew? Where the fuck is that in the Bible? Right. Black Hebrew Israelite. A black I'm like, that's the color. <laughs> Hebrew is a language. <laughs> Israelite is a nationality. <laughs> right. right. How old is that? That's crazy, man. That's a, well, they got to put it. They got to put a label. Every, they every church you go to, terms. man, they got to have a white image of Caesar Boy Jesus. Yeah. Right. Here we go. This right, is, man, uh, let's, let's do the challenge. Flush that down in the toilet instead of doing these dumb fire and ice bucket challenges. Oh, well, yeah, that's yeah, why the Lord yeah. said it. <laughs> Real Foolish, talk. Ridiculous. Such fucking But that's why the Lord What's said What's that verse, man? I shall smite thee with madness. Oh, my God. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. 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 I know that scripture. I got uh, yeah, 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 too quick. Uh, <laughs> I just came in. I just seen that scripture too earlier. Yeah. Man, like the Lord said, he said, uh, what was that, in the Gospel of John? He was talking to Pontius Pilate, and he told Pontius, he said, my kingdom is not of this world. If my kingdom was of this world, my servants will fight. So ain't nobody fighting, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. No. They, get the they fight against the each other. And they said we had no king to see. They fight against each other. Um, let me yeah. Yeah, they, they, they go uh, fight for Barack Obama, vote his ass back in the office. Yeah, and guess what? What's the symbol? The eagle, right? Yeah, that go back to that goes back to Zeus. They had they had us worshiping the devil for a long ass time. Yeah. And kids putting their hand to the chest, worshiping the flag. The flag, yeah. That's an idol. Brain to a flag. Yeah. But they they hardcore and idolatry. Oh, no reason that kids that. grow confused there. You know what I'm saying? God is stealing. Man. They like, they uh, said it's a hardcore business. Like in Sam, they they did it willingly. That's Israel. They they always want to be some that some opposite of what they supposed to be. Yeah, that's that that's that crafty council, man. Yeah, that, yeah, that's called yeah, the Illuminati. All that shit. Psalms 36 and 1. The transgression of the wicked says within my heart that there is no fear of God before his eyes, for he flattereth himself in his own eyes until his iniquity be found to be hateful. The words of his mouth are iniquity and deceit. He that left off to be wise and to do good, he deviseth mischief upon his bed. I got to pause back to that crafty council. Yeah, crap, man. So, like this script, there's another scripture that says, Psalms oh, oh. right, 36. Is that the one where it says there's no rest for the wicked? The, 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 the wicked don't really rest. You know what I'm saying? They work in uh, 16, 18 yep. hour days. Like it says, he divides the yeah, He don't want to go to sleep. He has nightmares at night. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I say every single day that the adversary is not messing with me, man. He just, uh, if, he, if he don't mess with me, he in trouble. Because I'm going to be able to take these crumbs and make a loaf of bread with them. Yeah. Help build his people up. You know what I'm saying? Take these nickels and quarters and dimes and print on flyers and wake people up. Yeah. They don't want that. <laughs> oh, I found that scripture you was talking about. Deuteronomy 28, 28. This is one of the curses right, right. that have befall on us if you don't follow the commandments. It's bad. It says, yeah, I should be in the grass, man. The Lord will smite uh the Lord will smite thee with madness and blindness and astonishment of heart. And thou shalt grope at noonday as the blind gropes in darkness, and thou shalt not prosper in thy ways, and thou shalt be only oppressed and spoiled evermore, and no man shall save thee. Oh, this is what we talked about earlier. 
right before you came up, we was talking about adultery. Right, right. Yeah, about how all these women are, uh, are, uh, are hoes. Thou shalt betroth a wife, and another man shall lie with her. Because you don't have a wife in this country. Just all you all you can get is a piece of ass. Yeah, you sad. get your turn with a whore. Yeah. That's all you you can't get is like you can't have children. You have children, they belong to the state. Yeah, what's that verse? And ye shall have children and not enjoy them. Yeah, it's all right here in Deuteronomy oh, yeah, 28. Man, you. That's the, you gotta read the whole Deuteronomy 28. 28. Yeah. 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 yeah, he ain't the Lord ain't lying to did it. Yeah. <laughs> Especially with the diseases, man. Infections man. and legs. Arthritis and man. Yeah, because I ain't got custody custody of my children. You know what I mean? They live with me on the weekends. I get to see them on the weekend. Mm -hmm. Kind of bullshit. They get to keep the Sabbath with your shit, you know? Well, we're gonna get out of here. Yeah. It's just for a moment. We're gonna look back and wish we were out here doing this work harder, huh? I'm trying to prove the mother unfit and neglectful, but shit, you know? All I can do is try. Yeah, yeah. It's already clean. Hold on. No, go ahead. Okay. I thought, what are you talking about? I care. Uh, I was no, reading Deuteronomy 28. I was just reading. He quoted that scripture. I, I was right, looking right, it up. I like that verse. I'm going to put that on the shirt. Yeah. 28. That's easy to remember. Deuteronomy 28, 28. Yeah, I can't see too good anymore. Rope at noonday, man. <laughs> Hey, he croaking. Uh, yeah, that's I all. You feel like you're at the warehouse now, man. <laughs> yeah, 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 that's, yeah. Well, that's crazy, man. You got to work yeah, 10 man. hours at yeah, the warehouse. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's all I'm saying. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, when the I was younger, I used to work warehouses and stuff like that. Well, I used to drive a Ford. That's, yeah, that, that's, that's when America had more. That's when they used to have more. Uh, off of Joyce and Fifth Avenue, they used to have a lot more. Uh, they used to have actual that's what I'm saying. Uh, trucking. You know, yeah. when they bring goods in, you ship them out wherever. There used to be a lot more manufacturing jobs out. And that was in the late 80s, early 90s. Now you ain't gonna fight all that shit gone now. But now, man, uh, like since like uh, 97, I've been working in the medical field, you know? Right. I said, no more of this hard shit, you know what I mean? for sure is that we all up here educated, so they can't say we ain't no dumb. Yeah, you know what education means? Yeah. Draw out. Oh, you know another thing too. To get a job, they have a problem if you got a beard. So but you know, my job, but yeah. you know, you can get a job though. Uh, one of these hoes can get a job. She can go in there wearing a. Uh, you can see her titties with got tattoos on her Cleavage titties. On that. Tattoos all. You can get a job the with tattoos. And all that. You can have. You could be one of these crazy white people yeah. that got uh, elongated earlobes. Yeah, I've been seeing that. They'll hire your ass. Yeah. They will hire you. You can look crazy as hell. And they'll hire you, but if you got a beard, no yeah, job for you. They scared. They scared yeah, of this, yeah. man. Yeah. yeah. They highly intimidated. It's something about a beard, man. Yeah. Well, that is a beard. The beard. Wait a minute. Hold on. Let me show you all I know the beard give you that all steroids. Leviticus 215, right? That's the all steroids. You know what I'm saying? All right, guys. Yeah, that's it. I told you, when I ride when I ride the Coca bus, nobody will ever sit next to me. Never. Probably because I look crazy as hell. All the thing is, you got the spirit of Most High. Yeah, that's it. And they got demons. Yeah, they got demons. They, have, they are feminine. You know what I'm saying? They like to have dick up the butt. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, it's right. literal, literal. Yeah, literal. Yeah. That's just like back in the ancient world, how the Romans, they be battling against the barbarians. All the Romans had clean shaven faces. And them barbarians came out with full they long beards. They were scared of that. Yeah, and it looked scary and fearsome. You don't want, even want to mess with them. You know what I mean? They said, they said the beard is a sign of manly dignity. Because you know, you oh, know Rome never covered it all the way up. No, no, no. They can't they go fuck like with it. No. It's too crazy. They couldn't they, 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 uh, they could go past they the Rhine. They couldn't go past the Rhine. They, I love having they a beard, man. I don't care what nobody says. Uh, I wish I could grow. That's part of my curse. I can't grow a full beard, man. Eagle. Eagle. This bullshit. Yeah, just, just, you think I want to look at me to see this bullshit? I just even up in England, they had to build a missing. They had to build an Adrian Wall because the Scots was too fucking crazy. I can't see it, man. I can't see it. But can you read it? There's a bunch of wild men. Beard. All right, this is the definition of beard. A badge of manly dignity. Oh, wow. Dignity. Oh, oh wow. that shit. A badge. You should read more than that. Oh. No, yeah, yeah, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, there, man. As back. a sign of mourning. Mm. Mm. Like it was the custom to pluck it out. You're supposed to look gay and happy. Cut, it Cut it off. that shit off. Look gay and happy. Cut it off. Feminine. Yep, yep. 
the Israelites were forbidden to shave off the corners of their beards. Yeah, so who was that? Uh, David? Now, he what's that, what's that one verse about um, yeah. Joshua uh, yeah, and Aaron the Canaan? Because was it, it was regarded as a heathenish sign. Yeah, right. it was one of the Ammonites. It was the Ammonite that shaved some <laughs> Israelites' beard off. Yeah. Man, I miss my And then King shirt, David man. told him to... Uh, he told him oh, yeah, to, yeah, to go hide that. yourself till it grow back. Till it grow yeah, back. All they did was yeah. go lay up with some bitches, you know. Yeah. Probably. That's what they did. They went, you know, Israel. Yeah. <laughs> went and laid up with some honey. Yeah, what's, what's that verse? Yeah. Now, you, you get some ass, man. You'd be surprised, man. Should not inherit Your testosterone grows up and their hair grows, man. Like, what's that, that, that verse crazy. about the um, idolatry, effeminate? Like, all those, those verses. I think it's in Corinthians. Um, somewhere. Uh, uh, oh, yeah. Uh, Corinthians 6 and 9. Right. And Romans 1. Yeah, Romans 1. Yeah. Yeah, first and also, Corinthians 6 uh, About Paul, they want to say he a European. They don't know who Paul is, but you read uh, Romans 11. Yeah, 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 hell, but most of your... That shit, that shit don't do that. That word European, oh, yeah, too, that's yeah. a propaganda. Paul yeah. don't, don't, don't yeah. even label with tribe of Benjamin. Yeah. Romans 11. Yeah, tell you from the tribe of Benjamin straight up. Yeah, flat out. Like, yeah, I'm from the tribe of Benjamin. Yep. Yeah. The stock of Abraham. So as far as a European, that's out the window. <laughs> oh well, yeah. Well, that that word European, that, that's a propaganda term too. That comes from Europa, a Greek goddess. You know what I mean? A mythological character. Yeah, the Israelites was living all through creature. Europe. And best believe, because you had uh, Israelite colonies. You know where yep. Tarshish is? Tarshish. Tarshish. You ever hear the ships of Tarshish? Like I mean, Solomon that, had that sent his <laughs> ships to Tarshish. They, the <laughs> Israel had colonies. Under Spain. Tarshish is Spain. Oh, okay. they, they was going to Spain Tarshish. getting all the gold. Even that, uh, Israel was going all the way up to, uh, uh, to Britain. To Britain. Yeah, to Canada, even. Mm -hmm. My, they was in Canada mining copper. They was in Britain uh, mining tin. You know what I'm saying? They, Israel was all over the world. Because there, there was this the in the Apocrypha saying that there was somewhere he had to take a three year journey. That's well, that, I asked, oh, when you break that word down, now let's get that. That's talking about, uh, we can just go into it, it says Azareth. And actually, when you look up that word, see, because we don't have that book preserved in Hebrew, but that word actually drives, derives from a Hebrew word, Aratazah, which means the earth. But it means the distant earth, is what that word means. I did some heavy research on this. That means the distant earth, the land that man has never been to before. You ever seen these dudes like in like red and white garments with that yeah, star we and everything? Yeah, we cursed. We went berserk on them. I know, I know y'all had to chop them up. They can't like, 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 church Israelites. Like, like, what that, you call that, it? That star I learned was when they got in the car and took off. It symbolized paganism. Mm -hmm. Sexual orgies. They color uh, represent uh, Rosicrucians too. The yeah. colors they wear. Yeah. Yeah. What they say? The star red man, yeah. Moloch. Well, I ain't the You'll star. I could break down the that star. That's that's the shield of David. That's not an evil symbol. Oh, and there's a lot of false information on that symbol. Yeah. Because that symbol actually has seven points. Seven, seven point star. Yeah. I can yeah. show you right here. Well, let me see. Right, a lot of uh, you more shit. That book we got. Nature has the uh, color lines, but uh, um, Moore's had the Star David on their shield. Yep. Yep. Wow. That's bad. Mm -hmm. What do they call it? Seal of Solomon, uh, Star David? It's, no, the Seal of Solomon mm -hmm. is a five-point star. <laughs> that's not even real. That's from a made-up book. I'm going to show you something. Get this, see if you can get this on camera. I don't know if you can pick it up or not. Now check this out. I got, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven nickels. You can use whatever. Well, watch this. It's a seven. Squeeze them all together. Let me get right here real quick. I don't like the Dragon Balls. I just got that one. I was just about to say that actually. <laughs> <laughs> That's where Dragon Ball, where do you think the Super Saiyans come from? That's the Israelites. Hey, hey. Dragon Ball is based on the Bible. See, coats of arms. There was a reason why I liked it so but much. But this though. is the Dragon Ball thing right here that goes back to the Shield of David. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, he said he used that symbol that, to cast that, out demons. That's there that's how you, that's when we you know were in Germany. Saying? These are German Israelites. But you see how many points did that got? So a six point star actually got seven points. The point in the center. Because actually, you know the six point star. Well, I got a video on YouTube to watch. I can't really yeah, do it out yeah, here. Yeah. And you count the edges on 
on a six point star, I got 12 edges, 12 tribes. And actually, you know how to spell David in Hebrew? Nah. Give me I'm a pen. Guess. Anybody got a pen? Yeah, I got one. I only heard yeah. some called Magen David or something. That work. Watch this. I'll show you how. I don't know if you can get this on camera. I'm not gonna write near a I'm gonna write, I'll write it in here anyway. I'm gonna write it in here. Here, here you go, here you go. You can write it right there. Yeah. Alright. You see? Yeah. That's an awesome book, right? You gotta read this book. That's one of the best books ever. That's a This is one of the J.A. Rogers is one of the best authors that ever lived. You ever read, read from Babylon to Timbuk too? Yeah, I, yeah. I used to have I had that book in uh, uh, the uh, yeah, I think good. I still got it. J.A. Rogers is better. I want to read watch that this. book also in, into Egypt again with ships. All right, watch this. I don't know if you get that on camera, but I'm going to show you how to spell David in he ancient Hebrew. All right, go for it. D, that's the letter D is a triangle. Okay. It's, it Hebrewly reads from right to left. Well, David's name, it don't matter, though, because I'll show you. It's D, W, D. That's David's name, okay? So if I take this. Mm -hmm. Flip it over. And put one there and take this one and put that there. You got a six point star. Uh, like looks like algebra. All right, oh, it goes deeper than that. I can go crazy with it. Yeah. Wanna go crazy with it? I get crazy. All right, watch this. That's why we, hey, after this, man, like when we're not on the streets or going to camp, like find some time, like during the week, man, we can hook up so and go over this stuff, man. David. Yeah. Yeah. I'm a hardcore workaholic, you know, man. Whenever you want to, man. Got me to pin down. Can y'all see this? Whenever you yeah. have time, man, I give hook you my number, man. We can we can hook up. Like I said, I do got a Facebook how, though. How you? That's how you become sharp. You you studying, yeah. man. Especially when you with brothers, man. I love. I miss it, man. We uh, used to have a cute studio. Yeah, you know the word math comes from a Hebrew word, amath. Yeah, that a sound right. M T H. And our math is related to the word amen, which means truthfully. So the word math means truth. But anyway, it got a six point star right here, right? Say, I always gotta do this because there's a lot of lies on that six point star. But watch this. If I connect all these edges, you see that's a that's a cube. You see that? You see the cube? Watch this. I'll draw a cube. Okay, yeah, I'll see you now. There's a cube. Alright, count the edges of a cube. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. There's twelve edges on a cube. If you count all the edges, it's twelve. I right, just got six sides. So if you count the edges, that's double the six, it's twelve. So if I do this, connect all the corners together. Get a six point star. I don't know if you can see that. One, two, three, four, five, six. So it all goes back to the number 12, bro. Spiritual. It's a spiritual number. You know what I'm saying? It's like people will say, uh, all oh, the 12 tribes of Israel, that's based on the zodiac. Have you heard people say that? No, I never heard that. Oh, that's some crazy shit. <laughs> <laughs> but a cube, a, a cube has 12 edges. Oh, yeah, look, the six point star. Let's get back to that. So this guy has six points, it really has seven, they count the center. That's seven. But if you count all the edges, it has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve edges. That goes back to the twelve tribes of Israel. That's why Israel used that as a sign. You can read, oh shit. You can read in Numbers, the uh, second chapter. Oh, it's an angel. That's <laughs> Numbers, the second chapter. Yeah, I'll get it real quick. Oh, them dudes that after red they look like Mortal Kombat or something. Yeah, they look like, like uh, King Ermac or he knew that yeah. was the guy was playing the Lord. <laughs> right. yeah, yeah, he he bad, man. Yeah, yeah. Because he ain't had nothing to say about it. Look like Raiden, huh? Uh, okay. Chill, uh, I thought you were saying. Yeah, that's what he did in the eye. Yeah. He got a bust out of here. Yeah. Yeah. But here you go. I'm going to prove to you where you can use them symbols. Going on her pumpkin as a motion. Yeah, a little bit. It's a sorority again. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, they, they, they worship. Know. And they don't even know. Heaven what don't even know what they doing. What, a sorority thing? Yeah. They just go because it's, it's trendy. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So they just fuck with it. You go along with the sorority? Yeah, that's yeah. it. Why they do that so they get a career? Yeah. You can't get a career unless you're part of a... Uh, 
part of a fraternal or a sorority. Ain't yeah. no more careers to get now. Yeah, check right, this out. Right. This place right. running out of careers. I'm going to back it up. They saying that um, student debt is like, they're about to default on that student debt, man. Hey, let me read this script. Better cut off the uh, student aid faster thing, huh? Yeah. Hey, Both listen. Raise their interest to like 25. I got a script. Here's a fuck. I got a script for you real quick. The them dudes you see, the ninjas? Yeah, what's up with them? They, they, they come from the old school. But what they did, they took the old original doctrine and perverted it. And that, because the leader of that church is a guy named Jermaine Grant, or uh, Tazadaki Kofi. But they call him the Comforter. They say he's the God sick Comforter. You they see him on YouTube. Yeah, they trying to, they say he's the Holy Spirit in the flesh. <laughs> That's what they teach. Our, our, elder, our elders, the dub, you know, uh, from Great Millstone, they come from that old school. And they, they know this guy. So they ain't a bunch of clowns, but say so they using a six point star, not because they worship Satan, but because uh, they come from the old school and they perverted the old doctrine. Mm -hmm. But what we and you don't see, so they said like, they the first church and everybody left them. They the still shut down. Yeah, the Catholic Church says that too. Look at this, uh, Numbers two and one, and the Lord spake unto Moses and unto Aaron, saying, Every man of the children of Israel shall pitch by his own standard. You see a battle standard? You ever see how people used to go into uh, battle with the standards? That started with Israel. That's so you can you know, identify who your brothers are and stuff, you know what I mean? So all the flags and all that shit, that actually go, Israel started that shit. Jacob is the former of all things. Yep. Every man of the children of Israel shall pitch by his own standard with the ensign of their father's house. Far off about a tabernacle of the congregation shall they pitch. So yeah, you're supposed to have uh, symbols. Israel had symbols, you know what I mean? They used symbols. And that, that whole, that's, uh, uh, them fake Jews over there in Israel, they stole that symbol. So that's why everybody thinks it's evil because the synagogue of Satan is using it. So I don't, People, they, everything, but they stole everything from us. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. They they stole. So how come the fake Jews don't even got um, a lot of them don't even have a beard? They don't wear fringes and ribbon. What they wear them? They got them big yes. dookie rolls. Yeah. Around the city, the city cut hat. Yeah, they got that. They say you shouldn't even cover your head. <laughs> yeah, the right, Bible said. Yeah. So they do everything yeah. totally against the Bible. Yeah. They, uh, uh, what, what's that book they got? That actually is the opposite. Town Mud. I actually got on my own. Um, what a town Mud. Some script Revelation 2 and 9. I see it. 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 The, you know, King James Version mm -hmm. scriptures. Mm -hmm. And right on the side was the Town Mud. What the scripture said, don't do. Right, right, right. Look right, up yeah. to the Town Mud. It said stuff that you right. pretty much saying you could do. Yeah, because they say you can. Um, you can start screwing and marry a, a three year old. Uh, no, she got to be three years and one day old. As long as, as long as she's three years and not one day, it's a sin. But as soon as that one day hits, yeah. you can pop her. And they say you can have three sex year old with little girl, boys. How's your daughter, man? See, th these motherfuckers looking at your daughter next year. <laughs> yeah, hey, right. you better, they man, at her now. You better pray to you. How about shim y'all our child? Because there's many kids that's being snatched up every day in the United States. They man. the main one snatching them up. You gotta pray to Heavenly Father, man, you protect your daughter, man. They got some foul ass people, man. They some foul, you ever hear about some foul people? That's, that's how you know, like. Foul people, man, they're now, fucking these foul. Brothers, uh, get together and pray. Pray in secret. But the church is right here. Well, we praying this right now. This, they're talking this prayer. That's right. But uh, you ever hear something called blood libel? Blood libel? Look it up on Wikipedia, the internet. It's called blood libel. Because the fake Jews, they like to snatch little Israelite children up off the streets. Oh, we got to turn them to McDonald's and everything like that, right? And they, they put the blood in their Passover bread. Yeah. They don't deny this either. They don't deny it. Yeah, I'll take care of it all. I got to get ready to be ghosts. When you own the judicial system, when you own the cops, when you own the military, you're going to do what the fuck you want anyway, man. I, I, I wish we could have uh, it's coming. over there. It's chance, man. It's coming. That's what's coming. That's why up. we out here, so we can get that spiritual power. That's why we out here. You know what I'm saying? We, you got to put in that work, man. This is that work getting out here doing this. A lot of people think, oh, you know, they teach, part of that old school way of teaching is uh, you're doing the laws. You can't, you can't even follow all the laws. The law can't save you. The law can't save you. Works and faith is what saves you. This is that work. That's why we out here.
And that's why we out here cursing these goddamn yeah. demons out. Israel yeah. and these other fucking God, nations. Because <laughs> Israel the devils too. You know what I'm saying? Israel the devils too. Yeah, we, we just try to do everything to the best of our ability, man. Yeah. All right, man, take care, y'all. All right, dude. Take care, Oh, I'm sorry. You ugly, bro. Yeah. Uh, I forgot. I forgot. He turned it on. Uh, all you gotta do is hit this record button right there and it stops it.